Welcome to SisrakhasKitchen.com. Today I am making Mexican rice with black beans. I have a lot of requests for this recipe, especially from children. I am taking some oil, about 2 tablespoons of oil. Now the oil is hot. I am taking about 1 teaspoon of cumin seeds. Cumin seeds are popped up. Now I am adding onions. I shredded the onions. Add a pinch of salt. Mix it again. Cover the onions and let them get soft. Now, here I have already cooked 3 cups of basmati rice. I used one and a half cups of water for one cup of rice. So this is three cups. Transfer the rice into a wide container. Just to loosen up with a fork so the steam will escape and it won't further cook. You can use any kind of rice like long grain rice, sona masuri rice or basmati rice. Any kind of your choice. Okay, in this rice, I am adding some sea salt and I am adding some uh, butter. And just mix it with the rice while the rice is hot. You may be surprised why I am using too much butter in it. White rice has more glycemic index than the brown rice whenever we use white rice we need to add some protein and fat to it so that the glycemic index will come down so that is the reason i added more butter if you are a vegan uh, you can use extra virgin coconut oil sesame oil or sunflower oil even if you are not a vegan you can use oil if you want okay it's, it smells so good okay i'll leave this here and let's go check the onions okay let us check the onions Okay, the onions are getting translucent now I am adding the black beans to it I took one cup of black beans and soaked in water for about two, four hours and then cooked them in the pressure cooker okay one cup of uh, dry beans yielded me two cups after soaking so you cook until the beans are soft like when you Press between your fingers, it should crush like that. Okay, now these are um, two cups of cooked black beans. Okay, I am adding to the onions. Black beans contain a lot of protein and fiber. They are very nutritious. And try not to use the canned black beans because they contain a lot of preservatives. To this onions and black beans, I am going to add taco seasoning. Okay, mix it well. Okay, let the beans and onions cook with the taco seasoning um, just for a few minutes. So the beans will get that flavor from the spices. You can get the taco seasoning in most of the supermarkets. You can use taco seasoning or fajita seasoning. Both taste very good for this Mexican rice. And it is actually very easy to make. You can even make it with leftover rice. This is good for lunch box. I sorted the onions and black beans for a couple of minutes. Now I am adding the cilantro, finely chopped cilantro. 
to turn off the stove. Now add this mixture to the rice. Okay, I am going to add my black bean mixture to the rice. Okay, and just mix it well. But let me clarify one thing. When you use white rice, I said to use more protein and fat. But it does not improve any nutrition like the brown rice. Brown rice is more nutritious than the white rice anyway. But by adding more fat and protein to white rice, the glycemic index will come down. Okay, here the rice has been mixed well. Thank you so much for watching my video. Please visit my website for more healthy recipes and like us on Facebook.